queries in access a query is the most important object provided by access 2010 it is just similar to a question and can give you information that you might not be able to find by looking at the table directly using a query you can search data from one or more tables by giving specific search conditions by using query you are able to view the exact data that you want you can then review add change or delete data from your database access allows you to create or build a query and save in the database so that you can run it multiple times the query design command present under the queries group on the create tab is used to create a query types of queries the different types of queries in access are select query it retrieves data from one or more tables it displays the record in a data sheet to group data and to calculate sum count average etc parameter query it is a type of select query which prompts you for the input before it runs it uses the input as the criteria that controls the result action query it creates a new table or alters your data by adding deleting updating and appending data from it cross tab query it is a query that uses a row heading and column heading so that you can see your data in terms of two categories at once query types setting up relationship an association between two tables on the basis of a common field is called relationship the common field in the first table is called primary key and in the second table it is called foreign key the foreign key field must match with the primary key field in the first table for creating relationship between two tables we need to first create primary key in both the tables to create a relationship create two tables table named students detail that holds general information about the students such as their role number name father's name and class table named students marks that holds information about role number marks and percentage to define relationship between the two tables follow these steps step 1 click on the relationships command from relationships group under database tools tab step 2 the show table dialog box will open click on the add button the selected table will appear in the relationship window after adding the desired tables click on the close button to close the show table dialog box step 3 click and hold on the primary key field of one table step 4 drag the mouse pointer to the common field in the other table and release the mouse button step 5 this will open edit relationships dialog box click on the create button this will create a line or relationship between the related fields of the two table creating a query to create a query follow these steps step 1 click on query design command from queries group under create tab step 2 the show table dialog box will open select the desired table and click on add button step 3 add the fields name to the query window and specify the criteria the parameters of the design grid in the bottom part of the query window are field it is the first row of the design grid that displays the selected field names from the table table it displays the name of the existing tables in the relationship window show this means that the field with a check mark will be displayed in the result and the fields with an unchecked mark will not be displayed when the query runs sort it displays the data in either descending or ascending order during the run time criteria this displays the condition on the basis of which the records will be filtered and displayed in the query output or it is used to set multiple conditions in a query after creating the query we need to run the query by clicking on the run button the related records of the query will be displayed in the data sheet view